everyone, Beata here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I've recently discovered the power of having a good scarf or a slightly bigger one, a shawl, something that you can maybe wear as a scarf or a shawl and having it in beautiful colors that's within your color palette will help you transform some basic outfits into something really extraordinary. The one that I'll be styling today is a blend between wool and silk. Um, it's got beautiful colors as I've already mentioned and it is 135 by 135. I am very surprised by how many ways I can actually wear this and today I would like to share those ways with you. So let's get going. You want to start off by having it in a triangle. So you're going to fold um, two of the corners onto one another so it doesn't have a rectangle but a triangle. Then you're going to put it around you, draped on your shoulders. You're going to take the two front pieces and you're going to tie them at the back. You're gonna have this piece covering the knot, straight over your shoulders. It's nice and secure, it won't fall down, keeps your shoulders nice and warm, and you have a beautiful look like this. For another evening look, you can untie this. Again, you have your triangle, and you're just gonna pop it over your shoulders but leave it hanging loose. You will be less restricted, but it might fall down. And that's okay, because that can even be a third evening look. Just draped over your arms. Um, I find this to be more secure when wearing something long sleeve because the friction will actually keep it from falling down. If you have bare shoulders, I prefer wearing it the second way, like this, or then secured with the knot. It's still in a triangle. I'm gonna drape it over my shoulders. I'm gonna take the two front pieces and not create a full knot, but just halfway like this. And that way it can also be nice and secure. Another variation is popping it over like this and doing the half knot, so it's kind of twisted here in front, and then pulling it through and I'm actually gonna pop this over my head for a wee second to show you. I'm going to take these two pieces so with the two smaller pieces I tied that I'm going to put the tri triangle over my from my head over my shoulders again and that way it's nice and twisted here in front it's really nice and secure, it won't fall off and it's slightly higher. The triangle at the back does not reach my bum, but it is rather right here at my waist. This is a beautiful evening look, but I also like to wear it this way during the day if I'm at work. I still have it in the triangle, I'm gonna dra drape it over my shoulders and I'm going to loosen my belt. Actually secure it with my belt. And I have a whole different way of wearing it. Now I'm going to take my scarf and I am going to fold it in a rectangle. From this rectangle, I'm gonna fold it once more. With my long rectangle, I'm gonna pop it over my neck and I'm just gonna tie it in the front. Now my neck is really nice and warm. If I have a blazer or a coat over this, I can tuck this into my blazer or coat and this way I am really nice and toasty. No wind will get inside. I'm gonna start off with my scarf completely big. I'm gonna take the two corners again and I'm gonna fold it into a triangle. Once I have my triangle, I'm gonna start folding the top piece in ever so slightly. I've rolled it in slightly and the idea behind this is to have um, this pointy end a little bit shorter. I'm now going to pop it over my shoulders and at the back I'm just going to give it a twist, bring it back to the front and you can pull this as tight as you want. I'm going to take these two ends and give it one or two ties in the front. Back to the rolled triangle, I'm going to continue rolling it up 
so it becomes one long big roll like this. I'm gonna place it in the back. I'm gonna give this a twist, adjust for tightness. And then I'm gonna take these two ends. I'm gonna tie it here slightly to the side or you can have it at the front, but this is called the 50 style. We are back to our triangle. This is probably the most simple way. I'm gonna have the point in front, center front, and I'm simply going to take the two ends, twisted ones at the back, and place these two just as is. You can decide whether you wanna pull slightly tighter so the ends are longer on the side, or you can have it like this, so it's slightly more breathable and all of these ends are almost in line with one another. Continuing from this point, I can pull this even longer in the front, then take these two ends and underneath tie them in a knot and this becomes And this becomes the waterfall. Again, we're starting with a triangle. I'm gonna wrap it around and have the triangle slightly off center. And I'm gonna take the slightly longer front part, so in other words, this side, and I am going to simply drape it over my shoulder like this. And I can then go, if I really wanted to, and bring that piece around again. I can stick it in here, take this end, give it a small little knot, and then hide the knot away. So it's draped over my shoulder or both shoulders, but it's nice and secure with the knot underneath. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed this. All of these ways also allow me to wear them not just in winter, but also through spring or maybe even summertime, summer evenings. If you haven't done so already and you want to join my channel, please hit the subscribe button. I'd love to have you here. Thank you so much. See you next week. Bye.